In this video, we'll look at how to calculate statistics for data that has already been grouped. So one thing to note, uh, again, because we are calculating standard deviation as part of this problem, is are we looking at a sample or a population? Um, right now, just because it's showing me that it wants me to calculate the mean X bar, X bar represents sample mean, and therefore I know that I am going to treat this as a sample and not a population. <clears throat> to calculate a statistic for a uh, set of data that's already been grouped together, we go to Stat, Summary Stats, but instead of columns, we're going to choose the bottom one, which is grouped or bin data. In this package, we need to tell it where are those the groupings or the bins, and that would be in square footage, and the counts are in frequency. When you use this, you're going to want to make sure that um, you are calculating the averages off of consecutive lower limits that will always need to be changed. Uh, that has to do with the way that the author writes the groups. Um, when we look at it here, he writes the first one as 0 to 499 instead of 0 to 500. So always select consecutive lower limits. Uh, down here we're going to select the statistics we want. In this case, that would be sample mean. Again, hold control and sample standard deviation. Then press compute and we have our mean and our standard deviation for the problem. I just wanted to again show you on the next problem. Uh, notice it says to calculate the mean and standard deviation, it, but it says to treat the data as a population. It also asks for mu. Mu is population mean. And so in this ca particular case, I'm not going to be able to use standard deviation when I calculate. I'm going to have to use the unadjusted standard deviation.